surrender immediately to the new lunar republic mortal for I will soon descend onto the world below and enslave your helpless race with my dragonborn powers. Oh noes. I must go and warn Headmistress Celestia and the others immediately. Brad, I love you, I've always loved you. Please Brad, why do you have to do this? I'm so sorry Rarity, you are an amazing horse and I'm sure one day the right guy will trot along, but I think I've found my soul made in Twilight. Oh, here she is now. Hey there Twilight. Assuming direct control. Rarity for the love of all that's holy think very carefully because the next thing you do could affect the lives of everyone on the planet. So basically headmistress this is why we need the extra 500 bits, to fund the computer offices, we can't do that much on Windows 95 these days. Oh potatoes. Well golly gee willikers it sure is nice to see you again headmistress Celestia. Or should I call you? Luna? Curses, I was hoping members of the new Lunar Republic were stupider than this. It's a good thing my blissfully ignorant sister is currently at her golf practices. Damn it, why? Pinky alerted me to your heinous crime, my sister. I cannot say I am surprised. Even before we came to this world you have known of its existence and sought to control it through whatever means necessary. I've done the research. I know you've altered the course of history throughout this world, even formed a conspiratorial new world order with people of similar evil intent. You cannot control and crush the will of the people. The new Lunar Republic will rise from the Solar Empire's ashes and free minds and bodies alike from your dictatorship's grasp. Also I managed to uncover evidence of all that money you've been spending to develop giant nuclear equipped robots. What a story Mark. Don't worry, Pinky. I'm actually a cyborg ninja. Oh my!